Hi there. Today, we're looking at a DC-DC buck converter module. Here's the input screw terminal where you connect the higher voltage source. And on this side, the output terminal where you get the regulated voltage. You have soldering points for both input and output. Next, we have these LED indicators. Right here is the potentiometer. It allows you to adjust the output voltage. At the center of the board is the LM2596S chip, responsible for the voltage conversion. And of course, the digital display provides real-time voltage readings. But why is this important? Voltage regulators protect your electronics by providing stable power. Without them, fluctuations could damage sensitive components like microcontrollers, sensors, or LEDs. This module makes sure your project runs smoothly and safely, even if the input power varies. For this experiment, I'll power the board with 24 volts DC using an adjustable power supply. Then, I'll adjust the output voltage down to 5 volts DC. Keep in mind, the board consumes a small amount of current for its internal control circuitry and the digital display. I'll also use the front button to toggle between input and output voltage readings. The LED indicator will show which point is being measured, IN for input or OUT for output. Now, I'll lower the input voltage to demonstrate that the output voltage stays stable. When the input drops to around 4.8 volts, the output is no longer regulated because the input is lower than the set output voltage. Then, I'll quickly raise the input voltage up to 27 volts, showing that the output remains perfectly regulated. Remember, this circuit can handle up to 35 volts DC input safely. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more Arduino and electronics content. If you'd like to support the channel, you can donate via PayPal or check out the Patreon link below for exclusive content and behind-the-scenes projects. See you in the next one.